everybody, welcome back to my channel and today we're going to be discussing five reasons why you should say no more often. And here we go. It says, trying to please everyone comes at a cost. You will most probably have heard the terms people pleaser. There is no doubt that being concerned about people's feelings is very important, but the cost to your health and well-being can take its toll. And that is so, 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 so true. So here we go. First one, reduction of stress. Now that to reduce stress, um, I, I don't know about you, but that is like, uh, listen, okay, that is like a big thing for me to reduce stress is highly, highly, highly imperative for me. So I love that one. Number two, um, you will feel less resentful. That is so true because a lot of times we tend to say, you know how like you want to, you don't want to hurt somebody's feelings. So you're like, okay, you're like, you know what I mean? And now you're doing it begrudgingly and nobody gets anything out of that. The person that you were helping and definitely you. So I agree with that one. Number three, you will sleep better. Okay, that's right. Because you're not sitting here harboring all these emotions and literally getting intense anxiety of the task that you know that you damn near don't want to do, but you said yes, so now you're obligated to do it. So now you're going to sleep and the day is coming, approaching to go do the very task that you didn't want to do, but you said yes because you were trying to be nice. So now you're tired and you still got to do it. Just saying though. Number four, you will feel more confident and that is <laughs> that is something I truly believe in, okay? Because you are respecting yourself. You know, and life is not about pleasing everybody else. The first person you have to please is please yourself. I'm not saying to be selfish by any means necessary, but you can't expect people to know their gauge. It would be nice, but you have to be your own lawyer. You have to know how far you how far and what you're willing to do and what you're not going to do and it's on you you can't get mad i used to be like that you can't get mad because somebody's not looking out for your feelings at the end of the day it's your feelings and you have to you got to protect it just saying though number five i like this number five more time to attend to your needs um hello that's right Okay, that is right. More time to attend to your needs because you're not sitting here running around trying to take care of this one, trying to take care of that one, and everybody getting what they gotta get, and now you're tired, okay? You're tired, you're exhausted, and you don't have time for you. So now you got all, you sitting here with all the stuff that now you gotta do on top of everything else, and now you're upset. Now you, now, now, now you just feel, you just, you're just a hot mess. So guys, I say it like this. I you I learned a long time ago. Regardless if you of what you do, you're never gonna please everybody. So why not please yourself first? Right? Anyway, I hope this was helpful. Leave a comment down below. Let me know, like, are you a type of person to always say yes and be helpful, which is a good thing, but do you find yourself depleted after that i would I, I really really would want to know anyway thanks for sharing it in advance and i pray that this video find you in great and lovely spirits and i definitely will speak to you soon bye